Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Ford Fusion this generation here from year 2013 to year 2020. If you need to find where the intake air temperature sensor fuse is located, which fuse you need to check, where you can buy cheap parts, tools, fuses, relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way you do not waste money and time. Well, it's always a good idea to test fuses and relays. All that guys will be, uh, will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure you stay until the end. So let us tell you a little bit about us guys. When we get a car here at the garage, we try to make at least 200 free repair videos absolutely to you guys. We make a video about every single fuse, every single relay. Let's say you're in the middle of nowhere, your car doesn't start, you can easily identify what causes that. You can search for engine starter fuse, uh, fuel pump fuse. Let's say that's a problem, you replace it, you're back in the road. It takes less than two minutes to watch the video guys. So uh, that will be guys our mission to make your life easier and to solve your problem. Now, uh, in addition guys, we have other channels as well. We make two 300 free repair videos on every car we get at the garage, take them completely apart. We do engine uh, work, transmission, body work, engine codes, fuses, anything like that. Now, why we do that? To save you money, guys. So, uh, on this Ford Fusion, there are different years, okay, through, uh, through the uh, different models through the years, from 2013 all the way to 2020. There will be some minor differences about the fuses, so if you uh, notice that we mentioned up to two, three different fuses for the same thing, it could be because uh, it could be a different fuse for a different year, but we're trying to help all of you with that generation for Fusion, so let's start on it now. So the fuse for the intake air temperature sensor guys, okay, where you can find it, we'll demonstrate on this generation Ford Fusion here. You guys have multiple fuse boxes, uh, but some of them are very hidden. We'll recommend to check the video on our YouTube channel about fuse box location on Ford Fusion. Open the hood guys, and here under the hood on the driver's side, you see that cover that looks like a T, go ahead, open it, underneath you'll find the main engine fuse box with a layout like this one. Before we continue, let's explain quickly why it's always a good idea to test fuses and realize. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys, when all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out so another thing guys before i forget if you guys need to buy any fuses realize parts tools for ford fusion or any car at a good price quick shipping we'll put a link in the description of the video below for your convenience that way you do not waste your money and time the intake air temperature sensor fuse is just one fuse that you will need to check. Now, quick piece of advice, you see these double fuses, guys. Always buy some spare ones, keep them in the vehicle because we were in the middle of nowhere. We needed a replacement and we couldn't find one, so we were stuck, guys. If you come in that row of fuses right here, come to the very uh, end, that's fuse number 29, which is a 20 amp fuse. One of the functions of that fuse is for the intake air temperature sensor. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time.